speech is on my phone. <laughs> I'm tech savvy. Um, guys, my name is Jessie Bowden. I, uh, I work in hospitality at Crown uh, in the food and beverage department. Um, are we going to the pub after this? Yes! Yeah. 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 So guys, I'm here today to stand up for everything, uh, for my rights at work, and just I'm going to stand with my union. I'm going to stand with everyone here, because what we currently have is stuff that is provided to us by um, by our unions. They're the ones that have achieved our penalty rates and our working conditions, so I'll stand by them because they have stood by me. So, penalty rates, guys, where to begin? What do they mean to me as a worker in hospitality? To put simply, and it's going to sound cliche, guys, it means everything. To a hospitality worker that does this for a living, it means our jobs. If you were to take away my penalty rates, you are looking at taking away over 30% of my paycheck. So, if the other government wants to take away penalty rates, I won't have a job in hospitality. I won't be able to afford to stay in the industry and do what I love to do for a living because he's going to take that away from me by removing penalty rates. For a living, it, it is a respectable um, job. What I do, um, you know, I work for a six-star resort in Perth here, Crown Casino. I've got the money to pay those penalty rates. I'm sure, they're not interested in keeping those either, though. Um, where am I? <laughs> so what I do, you know, working late nights and weekends and stuff like that, I, I forego time with my friends and my family. Um, but the penalty rates they make my job secure. Uh, and it gives me that livable income that I currently enjoy. Now, in WA, Mr. Barnett, he has said, on quote, penalty rates are too high. It is unfair that a worker... He has said that it's unfair for a worker to be paid twice as much on a Sunday than a worker working Monday to Friday. Is it your job to ensure a business's profit and 
a low labour cost or to create and cre keep Australians in sustainable jobs for the future. So guys, we, we all came here today and we're not really asking for a great deal. We're asking for pay, uh, fair wa wages and a secure employment. And if our Prime Minister cannot support us in this, he is not a Prime Minister that we can support. We won't support and we will do better.